Okay, so another quick update. Um, one channel that ch and uh, uh, let me watch this. Ch are both down. Um, one channel and uh, uh, let me watch this have basically converged into a single website, which is PrimeWire.ag, and I'm gonna go over how to switch XBMC to kind of temporarily patch it until the update is uh, released. At that point, um, if you're getting your add-on from the hub, it will automatically update itself and uh, kind of fix itself. But if you don't want to wait, um, there's an easy way to fix it here. Um, go to C, or your drive actually, uh, users, pick yourself, whatever you're logged in as, and you'll notice that app data is missing here. Go ahead and hit Alt. That'll bring up a, another row here of selections, tools folder options view and you are going to show hidden files and folders and drives apply OK and then you'll see app data once you're in there go under roaming and then XBMC add-ons and then there's your plugin dot video dot one channel under resources you'll see settings.xml and before I've done this I have went ahead and installed JEdit. Uh, JEdit is kind of a tiny little program but it's a uh, it's a text editor and it's a text editor that leaves the text intact as far as the way that it's formatted so it's very good for doing this kind of thing where you're editing a specific portion of a uh, of a file go ahead and hit OK uh, once you're on here, uh, line number 83 here, you'll see that there is uh, a domain name options here for onechannel.ch and let me watch this.ch. And I'm basically just going to get rid of the onechannel.ch. You want to make sure and keep the http colon slash slash in the www. And then we're just going to put in primewire.ag. And then I'm going to go ahead and switch my default here to primewire.ag as well. So leave everything else intact. The little line marker here. Don't remove or change anything else on this page here or you'll break it and uh, your plugin won't work at all. So just change those two things. Go to File. Save it. And now, when you start up XBMC, it should be defaulting to the uh, the new source. Go ahead and test it here. There we go. And this is all coming from PrimeWire now. We are up and running. Enjoy. Thank you.